Hey, welcome back to Jamboree. Except it's not Jamboree, it's Brothership. I keep getting Jamboree and Brothership mixed up. Why do I keep doing that? Whatever, I'm leaving this in. I don't care, it's funny. <laughs> Anyways, um, we are level 20. The bros are the bros are in their 20s now. They're uh, almost enough. They're almost old enough to drink in the states. I mean, they do live in Brooklyn, so I guess they can. You know, I guess they are almost old enough to drink. I don't know why the fuck uh, the age of drinking's 21, but it's whatever. I don't make the rules. I'm I'm Canadian. <laughs> you sneak past all those guards? Unbelievable! How'd you do it? There are guards in the next room, right? Between you and me, I heard if you find an intruder, you get a little more food in your meals. That's why the guards really put everything into their patrols. My older brother was brought here too. But he's been acting weird. Now he's even working as a guard. Dang, those poor guys are being put to slavery. This is where the cargo that arrives gets checked. I heard it has crucial gloss something in it. Handle with care, got it? Oh, they did ask out a factory here, too? Ooh, Patriarch's Note 2. As the people are forced to make loam all day and night in terrible conditions, I've heard this. We're so lucky to have our great Lord Zocket. I got goosebumps when the land split apart. I bet the next stages of his plan will be even more incredible. I can't wait to see it. I am fit to burst with anger, but I'll keep recording for the sake of the world's hero. From history's front lines, Patriarch. Wow. You know what? This is kind of, this is kind of uh, giving me some vibes. Uh, of how, like, there are certain people who, like, wish for the world, world's destruction or whatever. Ugh, give me a break. Give me a break. I keep doing this. The guys on the watch won't wake up. What? Wish you hadn't asked. Well, you can do this too if you want. Could have sworn I saw a hidden block. Alright, what do we have over here? Oh, shortcut. That's nice to have. I finally got a break, so I went on a great vacation, but then I woke up. Yeah, I was just really at work. Or I was really just at work. <laughs> There's a long conveyor belt in the room up ahead. I ran myself ragged working with the boxes. I think my speed ranking increased. Look, that arm is magnificent. The motion's so graceful. What foundation and balance, too. Better than the rumble dish. Huh. I feel positively tickled by inspiration. Incredible. Is there something down here? Oh, maybe I should go down there later. I've been able to outrun the shock bones in the past. I swear, I really could. So how'd I get myself caught by those birds? So, so, so busy. Hey you, don't just stand there, get to work. There isn't enough glow. Oh, never mind, the scary guys just want more of it. If I was gonna work this hard, I wouldn't work at a factory that makes glow all whatever we make here. I'd work at a snack factory instead. Sometimes a dark red thing pokes out from the cargo. What is it? It gives me the creeps if I go anywhere near it. Yeah. Well, I can't get up there quite yet. Can I go in here? No. I think we're supposed to drop down into that pit. Or go over here. Hey there, you guys have hammers, don't you? Can you do a thing for me? I gotta press the switch. But I'm having a heck of a time getting it to budge. Bonk. Ooh. One up, nice. Is there anything else in these? <laughs> Work an Amazon be like. <laughs> Ooh, 50 coin. Wow, there's a lot of boxes here. Damn. 
I guess this is, I guess it, this is what manual labor really is like after all. <laughs> I think that's all the boxes. Oh. All right. Well, we're going down to the pit. Wait, oh, I can't go down there? Alright, we're, we're riding it. Oh, what? That really feels like a secret, but I guess not. Am I not supposed to go this way? Hmm. So, oh, I go over here. Doesn't even, it kind of doesn't even look like there is a way over here. All right, so I have these guys, the uh, Spike Zock Trooper. I love how I love how the spike is the fucking the fucking like extension jack that I have for my headphones. That's really funny. Oh yeah, I guess we don't need to worry about what moves we use now because um, I have a. Uh, I got the expert for both of those. Whoa! Oh shit, I pressed the wrong button. Fuck. Alright, zap him then. Yahoo, 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 yahoo. Mushroom. There we go. Oh, yeah! Take a dump, take a dump. Okay, so we were gonna do infinite fusion today, but apparently Aaron is not free, so we're gonna have they're gonna have to do it next weekend then I guess. <laughs> That's too bad. More time for me to play Brothership, then, I suppose. <laughs> there we go. Yeet. Dang, I did a lot of damage. Yeah, this music is getting really catchy. I was actually humming this music yesterday. So you, you can tell I'm I'm getting into it. <laughs> candy. Wait, you did a normal ass candy? Not even like a super candy or nothing? I'm kinda surprised. Alright, so we got more yeah. workshop rooms. Yeah. Oh. Or, I guess you could say sweatshop, maybe. You know, this is kind of giving me, uh... It's kind of giving me, like, Okumura's palace vibes, honestly. Okay, another shortcut. I mean, yeah, we do need to... We, need to, we do need to make a way for, like, Connie to get up here after all, right? Okay, is there nothing down here? Oh! <laughs> There's not even like an animation of Mario falling off. He just goes, oh! And then he falls. Um, I mean, hopefully there's nothing up there. Unless there's like a secret hidden block. You know, it's worth it's worth a check. This would be a great spot to hide a hidden block though. I mean, maybe if I just jump around like a dumbass, I'll be able to find some items. You never know. Who knows? Okay, so... Oh, wait, actually, that, that, didn't, create a sh that didn't create a shortcut. I think that created the way forward. Bro, we're still getting frickin' mushrooms this late into the game? <laughs> Why the hell? <laughs> it's like Snake when he's like, who the hell? Yeah, well, definitely save after that. So question, do those Zocket troopers, like, stay, like, after I beat the dungeon? Uh, 
I mean, it might take a sec to beat those. Well, there's Zoc Troopers, 999 enemies, and then what are these two? That's what I'm not sure about. I feel like one of them... I almost feel certain that one of them will be related to, um, like, the Battle Ring, right? But that's if there is a Battle Ring, which I'm kind of... That's the thing. Um, previous Mario & Luigi games have kind of disappointed me in terms of how they handled the Battle Ring. Well, I mean... I'm not too disappointed that Superstar Saga didn't have one. This place, it's much darker than that other floor was. But I'm not scared, I promise. I was, I mean, maybe it was just being a bit unreasonable to expect the Superstar Saga remake to have one. And then the Battle Ring and the Battle Zinzai Story remake was a little lamer than the original. Well, for a few reasons. I mean, like the fact that the Dark Star, they recolored the Dark Star X to like yellow for some reason. Even though I, I kind of prefer the red the red color scheme from the original, but I suppose the Dark Star being yellow is kind of like a bit of irony, so it, it's alright, I mean, I suppose. I mean, it's alright. I mean, it's alright, like... Okay, so now I got a shortcut. Every Mario and Luigi game needs shortcuts like that. And I'm so glad they've been doing that all throughout the game. I mean, the, uh, the prime example of dungeons that do that to me is, um, Neo, Neo Bowser Castle from Dream Team. I love that how Neo Bowser Castle handles its shortcuts. How there's, like, three warp pipes in the very starting room that you can see. However, um, you can only access them after you beat, like, a dreamy se sequence, I think. And I really like how they handle that. And then I think they have another one after, um... I think they have another one at, like, the end of Neo Bowser Castle? It's been a while, but I, I think Neo Bowser Castle might be, like, one of my favorite dungeons in the series. <laughs> Bro, that didn't count as a first track? What the fuck? I think the reason why... Oh. Thanks for that. <laughs> Lucky! It's been, a li it's been like four years now since I've actually done Neo Bowser Castle for the first time. And I'd be excited to replay through it again when I inevitably do my Dream Team playthrough for the channel. Boom. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! I, I'm really tempted to do a hard mode playthrough of Dream Team, but I've heard that it's so ball-bustingly difficult that it made a lot of people rage quit. Oh, well, there's a hidden block. But I'm so tempted to do one. I'm so tempted to do a playthrough of it. Alright, I forgot these guys jump at you. Bro, stop being shit. Alright, last syrup. Oh, yeah! Wait, so hang on. The... That syrup... Did that syrup give me a boost? Or not? I can't tell. Well, I... Yeah, I've used this twice already, so clearly it is doing something. Sure. I'll heal Mario after the battle. I still find it funny that Mario sounds like freaking Mickey Mouse. Oh yeah! When the bad guys are flying, you gotta jump on them. Alright. 
Oh, man, I might as well use those normal ass uh, mushrooms. No beans? Oh, you can't even read the notes? That's kind of lame. Um. Yeah, there's no, um, there's no things on this island. Oh, bro's boost, uh, recharged. That's nice. Definitely using that for the boss. Hmm. Which one should I do? Oh, you know what? Let's do loot booster. I need more, like... Attacking plugs. My problem is that they only work with like the jump and hammer, but I don't want to be using the jump and hammer. Oh, wait, that's a new guy. Zokarang Trooper. <laughs> cool. I probably should let that guy attack then. Oh, I, I, you can't jump on top of it, unfortunately. Boom. Oh, he has like a different attack. Oh man, I'm cocking it up really bad, bro. You know what? Red Shell. We haven't done the red shell in a while anyway. I know in some games, I don't remember which game, but I know the red shell technically counts as a jumping move because you use your feet to kick it. <laughs> which I kind of find neat, honestly. I don't know if Loot Booster kicked in there. Alright, should I heal? Yeah, I'll use a mushroom. Oh, what the hell? Look at these spikes. Okay, is there anything down here? Whoa! <laughs> it's so, so stupid, bro. Alright, we got a normal ass mushroom and 10 coins. And that's it. That's literally it. <laughs> Nothing else. Ooh, wait, what's down there? Can I, uh. I can jump through there with the ball, the ball ability. Hey, that's a cool use for the ball ability. I wouldn't have thought about that. Oh! And we can uh, get over here. And what do we have down here? A syrup? A syrup? Oh, let me switch to the ball whenever I want. Well, how do I get down there? How do I get to those spikes? Do I have to turn them off or something? Oh, I guess we'll figure that out, right? Bro, the game girls are still fucking playing Danganronpa 3. I kind of forgot about that, honestly. Because I'm playing through Danganronpa 2 right now. Alright, I don't know which way to go. I don't know if I'm supposed to go down here or to the left. So does that turn off the spikes? No, that creates a shortcut. So I think this is the way I'm supposed to go, then. And eventually, we'll um, go down there and get those two, those two blocks potentially. Yeah, how do you get down there? Then I guess we'll figure that out later. This game really would benefit from being on the next Switch console, though. 
Alright, is there any shenanigans of us having to place the plug down to go to the next room? I don't think so. so. Let's just put that in. Oh, never mind. We do have to do that. Oh yeah. Okay. So they, they do want you to do this in a specific order. And they force you to get one plug to do it. Nintendo's Weird October. Yeah, how about Alarmo releasing? Yeah, that's pretty strange already. I never- I'm probably not buying into Alarmo. And by now, Alarmo's frickin' old news. Wait, now I can jump on it? That's weird. Well, these guys are weird as hell. It really fucking sounds like Mickey Mouse, though. I can't unhear it. Ooh. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, I've never really thought about the fact that Mickey Mouse and Mario kind of sound similar. Kind of. It's like, ho oh, oh, ho, you're gonna buy my games! <laughs> Yeet. Fuck. I still think one of my freaking favorite, uh, Mickey Mouse moments <laughs> is when Mickey Mouse is like, Oh, Goofy, this is some fine blow! <laughs> For fucking SML, where they go to fucking Disney World and Mickey Mouse and Goofy are just fucking smoking crack in the hotel room. <laughs> this shit is hilarious. Man, we're kicking these guys' asses. Oh yeah, I'm level 21 now! Oh shit, only one level left! And we get to see what the flower rank up bonuses are, because I don't actually know what they are yet, and that's the exciting thing. I really hope there's something good. See, like, I could have picked fast leveling, but fast leveling won't mean shit for something like the battle ring. Which is why I'm, I'm like, very strategic when it comes to my, uh, you know, levels. These guys are pretty cool, though. Pretty cool enemies. Yeet. I still didn't put the fucking Baku Yeet on my soundboard, god damn it. <laughs> also, I've been uh, I've been slowly working on some more uh, I've been working on some more Jamboree mods, because that's also been kind of been taking up some of my time. I mean that game is pretty fun to mod though. It's about as fun as Superstars, if not more, because I actually have access to the ROM FS. Oh yeah. Okay, so what's this all about? Oh, we're, we're, we're trying to make, like, a secret pathway. Okay, I see. Um, and I don't think we can get up there. Okay, well, let's... Oh, shit. We gotta make another pathway. <laughs> Alright. I saw a hidden block back there. Ooh, a hunter coin. That's our first hundred coin of the game, I think, or at least one of the first ones, I'm not sure. <laughs> hey, I need Mary, you can't fucking hammer those guys, it doesn't count. <laughs> it doesn't count as getting a first strike on them. Ooh, damn, four of them. Oh shit, I'm out of, I'm out of BP, crap. Period items. So that gave him plus pow. So yeah, spirit items pretty cool. 
Like, you get, you get buffs from eating items. Oh shit, I think I ran out of tea. I gotta go get some more. How are you, Bozo, still alive? Hey, Loot Booster. Thanks, Loot Booster. Whoops. <laughs> I did it too early. I think that's another reason why I don't like doing the hammer as much in the old games, because you have to, like, kind of wait for the hammer to charge up. Which I'm not too big on, personally. In this game, it's fun, though, because you get it feels more satisfying to do. Yeah, honestly, I think I really like the roulette uh, gloves. They're really funny. <laughs> Hey, loot booster kicked in again. Boom. Yeah, get that, get that bozo out of here. Oh, it would've been so funny if that killed him. Boom. It would've been dumb if uh, Luigi or Mario couldn't jump on those guys. All right, so a uh, funny thing, I, uh, I I took a little break <laughs> to um, watch some YouTube. <laughs> I think one of my favorite things right now is watching videos that just shit on how bad Jamboree's mini games are. <laughs> I'm allowed to be passionate about that game and also shit on it too, because <laughs> um. You know, I played that game, I played that game day one, and me and my friends all kind of agree that, yeah, the minigames in that game are very dog shit sometimes. <laughs> Again, we will eventually make our own list on the minigames once we play all of them. I mean, I could honestly make my own list at some point. But I'm not sure when that'll be, still. Just, uh, expect it eventually. Maybe in, like, the next few, uh, months or something, I don't know. I think it would be probably safe to do it after we played all the, uh, boards, probably. So that will definitely take at least a couple months. <laughs> I'd say don't expect a list on it until, like, January 2025, maybe? <laughs> I think that'd be, a, that'd be a safe time to do it. Alright. Almost there to flower rank. I kind of like the level. I kind of like the fact that they added seven ranks. Because, um... Well, hang on, is it six or seven? I, I do like the fact that there's seven ranks, though, because, uh, it means you have something to look forward to more often. Yeah. Um, so let me look at my stats. I think you can look at it here. Yeah, okay. Oh, damn, yeah, actually, there's there's still a lot of rank ups to go through. So we're gonna it's gonna go flower rank, leaf rank, star rank, and then rainbow and plus one rank. Yeah. Because that's how Paper Jam worked. You get rainbow rank, and then when you get to rainbow rank, you get another rank up bonus on top of that. So it is going to work the same way. So it looks like we still got a, white, a ways to go. Although chances are, I'm pro the game's probably going to end around like high 30s anyway, and then we're gonna have to grind to level 40. Or level 43, so... I probably will do that. But honestly, I never really had a problem with, um, grinding in Mario & Luigi. I find it pretty fun. It's a fun pa it's a fun little pastime, honestly. Whoa! Yeah, 
frickin' vine boom. Hey, it kinda sounds like a vine boom, doesn't it? Oh, I'm just- I'm just waiting for the time that- though that guy... He dies from hitting himself in the face with the frickin' boomerang, bro. This shit would be so funny. Actually, maybe, maybe we can do it right now. Oh, never mind. No spirit items? Dang, look at Luigi's like almost already halfway to the next level. That's funny. I guess giving Luigi that, uh, that, that accessory is good after all. I mean, I haven't been having too much trouble with the fights, honestly. What? What's going on here now? Oh, we got more, uh, more guards to deal with. Dang, that's a lot of guards, bro. There's even more of those guys. What can we do? I doubt we could trick. I doubt your trick from a four will work. Hmm. Oh. Huh? Eh. Hey, there's a battle up there, though. Luigi, you have a rather bright idea. You want to get launched up to the bales for some reason? Oh, yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Can't wait to see what you have in mind, Luigi. Well, how am I going to get up there? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Ah. And then I can bonk Luigi up. Well, there you go. That's one way to do things. So what now? Who's there? Oh, just totally a regular barrel. Is it... That's the plan, huh? Make a big commotion? So when we need to create a distraction with Luigi... Yeah, you just jump. Jump B whenever you need to get a guard's attention. So we can, uh... Jump here? Okay, I see how this is gonna work. Alright, and then... <laughs> yeah, definitely, definitely won't alert the guards that way. Bruh. How the fuck did I get spotted by that douchebag? Oh man, I gotta do that shit all over again. <laughs> That's a certified bro moment right there. He's too fast, man. I'm so used to all these slow- I'm so used to all the freaking guards being slow as balls. Alright, fine, do your thing. Alright, let me throw. <laughs> Alright, and then how the fuck am I gonna get How the fuck am I gonna dodge this guy? Do I just follow behind him? Yeah, I, I guess so. And then I, uh. Bruh! Why the fuck did he point downwards? Why did bro point downwards, dude? <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm- I mean, I mean I'm, to be fair, I am kind of trying to speedrun this, so... Yeah, you can't really speedrun it that easily. Okay. Right, don't stand down there, bad idea. <laughs> Cause if they even notice you for a split second, you're fucked. There. 
there. We're making progress. Hey, there we go. There's something. There's something. Oh. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. Well, the switch got pressed now, though, so I, I think I'm good. Wait, no, wait, the switches go back. God damn it. Alright, I'm so fucking sick of this stealth section already. <laughs> this is so annoying, dude. Alright, so we can we can go up here now. We're fucking done with that shit. That was annoying. I hated that. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well. Shitty uh, stealth section out of the way. No big boss rank for me. That's for sure. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, and then we can uh, we can actually go back now. Oh yeah. Okay, that's that's fine. I don't want to go back there anyway. That place was shitty. Yes, I okay. <laughs> Connie's Connie's doing great, guys. Trust me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like, you're thinking you have to, like, press B and A, but no, it's just A. You don't have to do- you don't have to do both. Alright, I think we're, we might be coming up on the boss soon, honestly. <gasps> I don't know. We'll see, though. Where is the safe point at? Hey, ain't there a safe point in this room? I don't- I don't think there is. I think there might be one up ahead, though. So let's uh, carry on. Uh, we got uh, we got some blocks. Hey, speaking of which, there we go. Well, thank God for the heal. So we are coming up on a boss then. These, these, these lighthouses actually don't take as long as I think they do. They only take, like, around an hour or so. Alright, I'm curious what the boss is gonna be this time. The efforts to amass Gloom are proceeding as needed. <laughs> exactly on target, Master. Now our next step to spread gloom everywhere. Lol, nope. Yeah! What? No, impossible. How'd they get past the island's barrier? <laughs> so that sound before That sound before must have been a barrier breach. <laughs> no need to worry, Master Zocket. I'll handle these pests. This kind of thing is what we have Shopcast for. Shopcast, get over here! Barrel Man! Master, hang back and watch the show, we'll take it from here. Oh, so that is your response, Eggs. <laughs> well, well, Master. First off, my name is X, as you know. Don't leave any survivors. They beat our mega. They beat our mega snapter, so don't hold back eggs. Not half bad. I've never faced a foe who's above average. But the shop gas will put a quick stop to your lucky run. Remember Goblick? Well, shop gas is full, full, far more spite bulbs. He's on an entirely different level of terrifying strength. Enjoy. <laughs> Ooh, bang. We got some more banger music. Oh, yeah. Alright, Barrel Man. Oh, shit. Alright. Um, I'm running out of spirit items. I need to switch out my items, first of all. Alright, take this off. Put on, uh... Where is it? Put on performance boost and bros boost. There you go. 
Now that's how we're gonna kick some ass in this battle. Just, yeah, just don't suck ass, that's all. <laughs> Yeet. Well, later in the game, we're gonna be able to use more, um, more outlets. I think he maxed out at five, which is pretty good. Oh, plug recharged. That's nice. This music's pretty good. I think this is like the lighthouse boss music or something. Bro, bro's healing. Do I need to like hammer him to get him out? Boom. Nah, he's just straight up guarding. Uh oh. Once he got in that stance or whatever, your tech stopped working. No point hitting him right now. We gotta knock him out of the stance. So this is a good use of Luigi logic then. Pile up the boxes. Alright, well, where are the boxes anyway? He's, he's taking like a shit ton of damage. Oh, and I love it. I love it. The battle background transitions. That's so cool. Alright. We got another Hatch Me Buchanan coming. This is gonna do some massive damage. 209 damage. Damn. Holy shit, 325. Oh, I got another turn. Yeah, let's use, um, let's use the green shell. This will do some insane damage. Look at this multi-hit. Boom. Dang, how much did that do? 199. Wow, really good. They had like 500 damage in one turn. Oh shit, he, he's getting buffs. Oh my god, I'm taking, I'm eating shit, bro. I need to heal up Mario, stat. Um... What else can I do? Can I do auto mushroom right now? No, we have one spirit item left. Let's use it. Alright, nice defense up. Got him. Alright, let's see how much this does. Wow, that was like as close as it's gonna get to maxing out. Yeah, that doesn't actually do all that much. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, let's use a super mushroom. 
Oh yeah! Bro's getting a buff. Oops. I'm pretty bad at dodging that. <laughs> I should have put on auto syrup, honestly. Ooh, nice lucky, though. Bro's getting angry. Oh my god. <laughs> Man, I'm eating shit. Yeah. All right. Um, we got a candy, don't we? I guess I am actually using my candies after all. Fucking wrong button. God damn it. I don't know what I was supposed to do there. I'm trying to jump on him, but it's not- oh, well, there we go. It's not working too well for me. Now, this, this boss is actually giving me trouble. That's, that's, a good, that's a good change of pace, I'd say. Like, barely did anything. 63? That's like nothing. I need to land Mario's, because they're, they're single target. There we go. Boom. There we go. That's some damage. Yeah, these, these bosses are definitely getting a lot harder. I'm pretty happy about that. <laughs> hey, Luigi gets to be flower rank now. Alright, what are the rank up bonuses? Jumpman and Hammerhead are back. Okay. So, well, they're only by 20 in this game. Hmm. I should definitely give Luigi power up though. Yeah, that or speed up. Hmm. Well, do these apply? Oh, hang on, do these apply to jump? Like, cause here's the thing, right? Some bros attacks, some bros attacks use the jump. Like they use jump to calculate how much damage it does. Yeah. I don't know. It's tempting, though. But I'm gonna go for power up first. So now Luigi's gonna be a lot stronger. I really should have gone for power up sooner, though, honestly. I might go for a jump ban. Oh, damn. I just got 40 free Luminae, bro. Ah, such burly perfection, and still it comes to this. You're to an X. You guys have pain. Until next time. Oh, dot dot dot. What's that glowing thing? Oh shit! It's a power tap expansion pot. You got a power tap, yay! So we can have three things now. So those are, those are, um, those you get by progressing through the game, not through level-ups. Oh hell yeah, dude. I'll, I'll, I'll think of, I'll think about which one I'm gonna upgrade next. 
Yes, let's get to the top of this great lighthouse. There are plugs you can crap. I don't know if I don't know if there's any of the ones that I want though, because I kind of want the um, hmm, icy attack sounds kind of cool, honestly. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I think I might go for icy attack, cause that sounds pretty awesome, actually. All right, here we go. Yep, top floor. Well. Burp. Okay, that actually took a little bit longer than I thought. So it's a good thing I, uh, saved it. Now we can light the great lighthouse here in the colorful sea. I'm grateful to you both. Oh, and to you too, Snoutlet. Now I'll go on ahead. Okie dokie, let's go. Oh man, I really hope the final boss music is like something really epic. Like, I hope it goes as hard as it did. I, like, okay, so here's the thing, right? Keep in mind, the guy who did this soundtrack, he, he did the fucking final boss theme for Smash Ultimate, and that shit's a banger. If we get something like that for the final boss theme in this game, dude, I, I'm gonna be happy. <laughs> I, the thing I love about the recent Mario Luigi games is the final boss theme goes hard for no reason. Like, the, the rest of the soundtrack is good, but the final boss is just like on another level. And that's what I'm really hoping for with this game. I know it's a little too early to say that. But, you know, I'm, I'm hoping it's something good. Come now, Light, find your shine. Show us the path we must take to restore all of Concordia. Ha ha ha. She's levitating again, Luigi! <laughs> we get more wholesomeness. More wholesomeness to light my day. <laughs> Love how Mario, Mario's happy and Luigi's just shocked. <laughs> So I think this officially marks the halfway point in the game. Oh! Yes! This is a pretty good dungeon. And even though there weren't any- there weren't- even though there weren't that many new enemies, I really love the whole, like, factory vibes, you know? Yeah, we got a new, we got an entirely a new set of sea to go across. Dang, that's some nice water. This is about 1080p, actually no, 4k, 8k water. 8k water. Celebrate! Look at all those islands that we get to bring with us now. Oh, yeah! We're gonna get a good look at all of the, uh, all the islands that we saved. Dang, look at all those islands. Man, how are they gonna render all the islands when we get to, like, the fourth lighthouse? <laughs> They're gonna have to really cut corners on that one. We're almost at the Burning Sea. That's the third one, Burning Sea. We're getting closer all the time. Oh, yeah. Yay! Yeah. I'm so glad I met these two. My mentor, Cosette, told me that helping one another is important. I'm sure that Mario and Luigi can help. I mean, they will. Miss Cosette. I'll get Concordia back together. Maybe then I'll see you again. 
Whoa, neat. This is so cool. Oh yeah, are we like we freed all the people from the uh, the factory, right? Going somewheres? Yep, we're off to explore. Dory's full of energy thanks to the medicine. Huh. Thanks for waiting. Uh huh. Wait, you saying Princess Peach and Stylo are? Uh... Yeah, we're going with them. I wasn't sure what to make of this world at first. But after meeting the people and seeing their homes, I want to help save Concordia. And that's why you're exploring? <laughs> we are. Idol. From now on, consider us members of Idol. Yeah, I noticed the, the, that Peach has the little wristband or whatever. Well, the scarf around her arm. Yeah! She's so cool! Like Chris Pratt. Well, uh, you wanna- you want us to come with ya? Nope, you have an important job right here, remember? It's your turn to look after Mario and Luigi. Haha, <laughs> Roger. You can leave it to me. We'll be doing our part to explore this world and its seas. If we find anything, we'll let you know. Mario, Luigi! We'll save Concordia, and then we'll go back home together. Oh yeah! Oh, yeah. This is so exciting. <laughs> Presenting the Reborn Idol. Let's go. Our new mission to sail the seas. I think this is gonna be the cutscene from the trailer, right? Yeah! Yeah, there it is! Oh shit! Bye, Starlo! <laughs> See, all, the, all you Starlo haters can shut up now, she's gone. <laughs> I'm like, I, I'm indifferent towards Starlo, though. I'm, I, like, I don't love her, but I don't hate her either. She's a sh I mean, it's all right. <laughs> At last. But no, it's still not enough. More. We must have more gloom. I don't know what his ambitions are yet. I guess we'll figure that out. So now we're in the third C of the game. Burning C. Doesn't really look that burning to me. Whatever. Nothing but water. But I guess that's what you'd expect at C. We gotta keep at it until we find drifting islands. Heh. <laughs> Let us look for drifting islands and double back to ones we linked already. Well, we got a new side quest, though, first. The Courier. Apparently there's an easy job on Rumble Island with big a payout for just delivering something. Sounds extremely legit. Rumor has it that something unfishy can be seen from the fishing spot. If you fish now, maybe you'll catch it. And Monster Mania. There are fearsome monsters on Merry Go Island. A champion is needed to defeat them. Alright. I guess we'll do the fishing thing first. Maybe I can fish up someone's dreams now. Uh, I gotta do some fishing or something? Is that what that's all about? Um, yeah, it just says try, try switching, try changing bait or switching bros. That's all it says. So, time to go fishing again. I guess it's time to go fishing again! Bullion fish. Um... Honestly, I feel like getting me some frickin' marble bread. I'll be right back. Alright, well honestly, I don't know if I feel like doing, um... I don't know if I feel like doing this fishing shit right now. So instead, we're going to, um... 
We're gonna go, I guess we can go to Merry Go Island again, or we can go to Rumble Island. Let's do Rumble Island first, because I fucking hate Merry Go Island, honestly. <laughs> oh wait, wrong guys. The pipe is over here. And also, apparently I need to get that one of those grand grandpas on uh, All Sand Island still. Do you have a request? No, I think he's- I think he's still got the same shit. Wait, getaway gloves? <laughs> Increase speed by 50% when you have no wear equip. Huh. Increases stash based on how many plugs you own. Oh, that's a funny one. Um... Restores 5% of your max HP at the start of your turn. Increase the speed of your battle plugs recovered by two times. Oh, that might be a good one, dang. Gee, you know what? I might buy that. Well, what is Mario wearing right now? Coin glass. Yeah, yeah, put that shit on. Chart double the speed of the battle plugs, and you get plus one in all your stats? That's pretty good. I, I love how recently the Mario and Luigi games, they love this frickin' trend of like, hey, if you don't wear any armor, you get like, a plus 20 pow. <laughs> no wear. Like, by no wear, that means like, no, like, gear? Like, like, no, um, no overalls, right? No wear at all. Like, just, none of this, n like, none of these three things? Like, I feel like that kind of defeats the purpose, because, you know, you get- you get power by wearing this shit. Or whereas in this, like, just the-, the this, right? No gear? No gear? So it's kind of- in a, in a way, it's kind of like the, um, the Dark Star wear, where it gives you no defense, but it gives you plus 30 power or whatever. Or something like that. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Well, Rumble Island should be easy enough to do. Maybe I will do the fishing, but I won't keep it in. I'll cut it out until I get the one that I want. Because <laughs> there's not really much entertaining about that. Rumble Island's a nice starting island for the game, honestly, though. It's unique enough, and it's not like your typical grassland, either. Um, so where is this package at? Oh, it's all the way up there, okay. Oh yeah, now that I have three plugs, I can kind of screw around with more shit, which is really good. Alright, so, I'm gonna wait on making plugs right now. So what do we want to make? Um, put on loot booster, that's always a good one. And auto syrup I think would be good. Hammer is, I mean I don't mind these. Hmm. I haven't really found a lot of good combinations recently. How is my stats doing? I'm maxed out. Okay, good. Keep quiet. Hey, I know you. You're Mario and Luigi, right? The famous ones? Glad you're here. I need a favor. It's nothing big, I just need someone to deliver a package. What's in it? That's classified. Who is it going to? Also classified. I, I, I can only tell you where to bring it, the rest is top secret. Hmm. Any questions? No? So you'll do it? If it helps, there's a generous award. Wow, you're really down for the sketchiest job in Concordia, huh? You're taking it to a building on Lotta Coins Island. 
You'll get your reward there. Make sure it arrives there safe. It's my masterpiece, after all. Gold medallion. <laughs> okay. In that case, I will go to... I will not do that. And I will go to Merigo Island instead. Because I can just warp right there. As long as I don't have to deal with the maze, I'm fine. They were really proud of this maze. They made you go through it like three different times. Well, let's see. Where is it at? Oh, it's right over there. That's not too bad. <laughs> oh ho ho! You look like you're our first challenger. Monsters, such creatures offer endless possibilities. Battle bravely, learn bravely. Welcome to the fabulous world of fantastic battles. I'm Maniac number one in the Monster Maniac Club. Our club absolutely loves monsters and collects fascinating specimens. Our club spends days researching monsters and their habitats. Even within one monster species, there can be a huge amount of variation. Stronger variations, weaker variations, pretty fur, cute voices, anything. We've had a real humdinger recently. A doubly dangerous variation. Marvelously mutated crows! Those monsters boast truly top class toughness. Further fortify with a dis disbursement of defense beans. I may, in fact, have dispersed a few too many. I'm worried they'll break, they'll get out of control if they break free. Why taking them down before they escape and go on a rampage? I'll have a special award for you if you can do it. I'll warn you, that's a pretty big if. So, think you can floor my extra tough crow, hmm? Well, yes. That's the best, that's the spirit. By all means, give it a try. Just show when you're ready for this mind and body. And I also get defense beans for doing it. Uh, I'll save, just to be on the safe side. What plugs did I put in again? Oh, those are some good ones. Where's the save point at? Oh, it's up here. Well, this is an actually uh, fun and entertaining challenge we got here. Ooh, and Mario might actually level up to... He might actually rank up from this, too. Monsters of Bosses, come hither! Ooh. If you feel out of your depth, you can always flee battle. Hey, I'm down for a challenge, man. So what are these guys' deals? Crowed R. Okay. Let's see how much the Zapparator does. Oh wow, he wasn't kidding. <laughs> he wasn't kidding when he said they were uh, tough. They only take three damage a pop. Alright, let's see how much this does. Boom. Three damage. Two damage. Wow. Yeah, we really ain't doing any damage. Whoops. Man, I'm taking some damage, too. Bruh. I can't dodge for shit, either, apparently. Alright, first one-up of the game, I think. I think that is our first one-up. Then the the encounter the freaking counters don't do shit either. So can I beat these guys? I wonder. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, maybe. It's worth a try, right? Yeah. 
freaking two damage, dude. Unless there's some easy way of doing extra damage to these guys. I mean, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try my damnedest to do this. Ooh, there we go. There's some damage. A little bit of it, anyway. Oh fuck! Luigi got tripped from that. Lucky. Well, rep my empowering counters. All right. Um. Surprise iron ball. Boom. Oh, that that does damage. Holy shit. Yeah, do that more. There we go, there's some damage. <laughs> One damage, bro. Oh fuck. I need I need to I, I, I actually need to use a nut. Like dead ass. Do I have an ultra nut? Yes I do. Perfect. Well, I found the cheese. That's how we're gonna get rid of these guys. <laughs> yeah, I won't take shit from you guys. Boom. Three damage. Well, what happens when I run out of the iron ball, though? That's gonna be a problem. Hmm. I don't really have anything that does extra damage, do I? I guess Kaboom Attack. Yeah. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, do that, please. Alright, good. Okay, so what we need to actually do is we need to jump on this guy here. Then it'll hit all three of them. Yeah. This isn't too bad. <laughs> I love the surprise iron ball. Yeet. I wonder if anybody's I wonder if anybody's figured out this strat. <laughs> to just use iron balls. Boom. I mean eventually I'm gonna run out of them though, so that's the problem. So I gotta make the most out of it. Yeah, my last iron ball, sadly. Nice lucky. Well, I'm out of iron balls now. <laughs> I think this guy is close to dead anyway. Yeah. Alright, well. That one's out of charge, too. <laughs> Alright, well, now we gotta put on some new plugs. Like Dizzy Attack and, um. Ugh. I don't know. Loot Booster, I guess. Doesn't really do that much. Oh, he's, he's dizzy now. Boom. 
And that definitely helps. Because now he's dizzy. Yeah, that definitely feels like I'm doing a bit more. Yeet. Actually, out of curiosity, how much does the red shell do? Let's see. One damage, yeah! Alright, he gone. I didn't even get that much experience for that. I didn't even get a level up like I thought. Oh yeah! Incredible. Honestly, I didn't think you'd be able to defeat them. Here's the reward I promised. Please take it. <laughs> Goodbye and thank you. Oh, my dear little crows. Well, I am gamer. Well, time for me to be off. I must find stronger monster. Is it gonna be the same guy every time, just with different enemies? Alright, well, um... Yeah, we'll split them evenly. That was, that was actually, that was really fun, I liked that. It was fun figuring out that you have to cheese them with iron balls. <laughs> okay, so where are we off to now? Um... Well, we gotta head to a lot of coins now. So we'll, we'll just do a bunch of side quests. Well, we have all the Luminae we could possibly get, so I'm waiting until we can go to the next island to get the next ones. I think. I mean, I don't think we can get all the ones on All Sand yet. Yeah, I love this jazzy song. Where is the guy? It's in one of these buildings. Mm. Yeah, I gotta figure out where that guy is. I came from Marigo for a bit of fun, but I can't seem to relax at all. All these people in their business suits, these buildings looming above us. I thought this would be a cool place to relax, but I was so wrong. What, the gates open, but I didn't do anything. My son forgot his lunch again, and I came as usual delivery and got here on time. He's embarrassed that I do this, but it's a lot better than a lot it's, it's better than a lot of tumbly rubbing. I'm guessing there's nothing in here. <laughs> yeah, this is empty. This is one of my favorite songs in the game, I'm gonna be honest. Oh wait, you're well. I heard all about you from the upper management. You took care of some really bad problems in our company, thank you. People think that making time for co-workers who vent is a waste of time. But it saves them on time on other things. People trust me more so we get more done. Now that we can go to other islands, my dating pool just became an ocean. Okay, so nobody, uh, nobody on this floor, I think. The delivery? Who's the recipient? I don't know! Oh, you can't tell me? This isn't usual procedure. What's in the package? Uh, you shouldn't say? That's kind of weird. Oh, wait a minute. You think this is what the boss ordered in secret? Uh, it could be. Yeah, I'm afraid you got what you got there is the stuff our boss ordered. Look at the time now, he's probably watering plants on the third floor. Okay. Gotcha. So I was supposed to talk to someone on this floor. Well, this is the third floor in it. <laughs> oh, time for my next meeting already? Ah, busy, busy, busy. Bro straight up ignored me, dude. And the burps don't stop coming. 
Where'd the boss go? You lost sight of the boss? Well, he's a busy man, so he's not easy to catch. Well, he might just be in time. Yeah, good call. I think he's about time for him to take his lunch break. Try the boss's room. It's at the end of the hall at the top of the stairs. At the top of the stairs? What are you talking about? The room uh, to the right? Let's try this room. Hey, there's that guy standing in the pit in the window again. What is this his room? Nah, this ain't it. This ain't it. This ain't his room. I don't remember where his room is at. I like how they still have those numbers on the wall, even though they don't do shit now. Wait, these guys are still here. What the fuck? I guess this is in case you want to grind those Zoc that Zoc Trooper achievement. I guess. Bro, how do you fuck that up? Dude, how, how do you fuck that up that badly? <laughs> I'm getting so distracted that I'm messing up the bros attacks. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Yeah, a lot of coins lever. Ah, oh, Mario's so close to a level of these. So yeah, how am I doing on uh, challenges now? Oh, I'm I've gotten 105 luckies so far. 141 to go. Yeah, this one's gonna be. We're gonna finish this one pretty quick, actually. Deal a thousand damage or more. Uh, 5,000 coins left for this one. What's this one? Gonna be a coin master or something? No wear gloves or accessories? I think the reason why that one's so annoying to do is because I have to unequip everything and then if I want to put it on again, I'm gonna have to put it on, put that shit on again. That's why I'm thinking about just grinding for it later, later in the game. Because it's more convenient that way. Alright. Luigi time. Okay, I, I guess I just lost the rhythm there. Yeah, plus you just get a crap ton. Oh wow, look at all that stuff I got. Super nut. There we go, there's my level up. I mean, I might as well go with, like, Jumpman or something. Jumpman and Hammerhead. <laughs> so, I mean, I could get quick leveling, or I can get Jumpman, which would actually matter. Let's get Jumpman, why not? Lucky! I could go with Stash up, but Stash isn't as important in the long run, so... Yeah. How's anybody gonna get work done with all these frickin' Zoc guys in the way? I don't know, but the fact that there's so many of them makes my job a lot easier. Yeah. I like how um I got a lucky on one of them and then one of them died. I 
pretty good at alternate mashing. <laughs> something, I, something a lot of my friends can't say. <laughs> Like that time I beat uh, I beat Zack in that Mario Party 5 minigame where you gotta alternate mashing L and R. I remember that. Good times. Uh, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna be playing Mario Party 5 much in these days since we're focused on playing uh, Jamboree and all that. Okay, is this where his room is? Mm. Oh, we'll find out, I guess. Where the fuck is he? He's not in here either. Am I dumb? It said his room at the top of the stairs. So that's why I'm confused. And I checked in here already. Oh, well hey, these guys are here. I don't know when the fuck these guys got here, but sure. Mario is a good, like, a really good AoE move. Cause I don't have one yet. Boom. Got it. Oh yeah, the difference there is kind of immaculate, isn't it? Oh yeah, right, I still have the dizzy thing on. Super nut. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? Might as well do it. And there goes my, uh, there goes my things. Gotti. Uh, that's the shit right there. Honestly, I'd prefer to give Luigi more speed, because then Luigi can use his AoE at the start. This is like the perfect place to grind that achievement, though. I call them achievements and not challenges, I don't know why. <laughs> Honestly, I personally don't mind the fact that, um... I don't mind the fact that there's not as many challenges, because these ones take a long time to do. Like, how how much- how close am I now? Yeah, 116 left. We're getting closer. This one is still gonna take the longest. And hey, then we'll be able to figure out what the last ditch gloves do. Look, look at that. I've, I've only beaten 600 enemies, and I've been playing this game for so long now. <laughs> That's why it's gonna take a while to grind that one out. That's why, uh... Yeah, I probably should have been playing the game with no wear, honestly, all this time. But... Whatever. Alright, I still can't fucking figure out where that guy's office is. I think I have an idea on where it is. I think I'm dumb. I think I need to check at the top of the staircase. So, I'm gonna go there. This place's layout is still hella weird, though. Really, ain't there, um... Ain't there, like, a... Office over here? I think this is where it is. This is the only other place I haven't looked yet, after all. Doot, doot. This is the boss's chamber. Access strictly controlled. There, my gosh. Leave us, please. Of course, sir. Oh, no. 
Did you bring it? Show me. Mmm, thanks. You can claim a reward from my assistant outside. I guess I'll never know what was in that present. We had another job done. We never found out what was in that box, huh? Here, your reward. Magnificent! Oh. Oh. Such quality! No wonder he's known as the Master Craftsman of Rumble Island. The craftsmanship. The artistry. I'm in awe. Damn, bro. So, he was horny that day. That thing? What's the pig deal? So bold, so commanding. My Wilma! Again, thank you. Here's the reward. You were never here. Tell no one of the val this valuable sculpture. Is that clear? Now that was a suitable place of honor for you. Bro, I... I... <laughs> Bro, he... Package received. I'm grateful to you. I feel like I can get a lot of work done. <laughs> uh, well, guys, I think the boss is horny. My boss is fierce, smart, and canny. That's his reputation. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I won't judge him. At least he didn't order a body pillow. <laughs> Surprised they were able to get away with that. Damn. <laughs> Get ready E for everybody, guys, am I right? <laughs> that makes me wonder. Is that um does that does that mean he's he's his he's uh her husband? Or is he just simping? <laughs> we'll never know, I guess. Yeah, we'll never figure it out. Okay. Um I'm gonna go fishing, so uh, I'll meet you guys back when I'm done with that, because I need to get that done with. Cool transition, go! I got it. I got a note. No funny transition, but yeah, there you go. <laughs> How long has it been since I've sent flying to this island? It's a small island, that's for sure. There's almost nothing on it. Just pipes, that's it. Pipes. I'm bored. Nothing to eat but grass. Only clouds for companions. Now my cab's drying out. I have little hope that I'll be rescued. But maybe throwing this message out to sea will do something. Whoever you are, if you're reading those words, PLEASE HELP! There's a single thing from the letter. Oh Mario and Luigi, I hope you're both doing well. Please Princess Peach, forgive me. I won't be returning for a while. I wonder what island this castaway came from. Huh? Deserted Isle? Castaways? We've seen something like this before. Remember all Sand Island brothers? They might know something about this. Oh, yeah. The Left Behind Toad. Go and meet them, that lost toad. Also, I got a shit ton of fish. I, I, it got, it took, this took me like 10 or like 12 freaking attempts to get, so... I'm kinda glad I paused. So let's uh let's sell some stuff. So um we got some coin fish that I can sell. Um bullion fish. These are these are for making equipment, so I won't sell them. And uh well obviously we're gonna we're gonna sell a couple of these. Not all of them, just a couple. Can you make anything new, by the way, now that I have fish? I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell. Stash Stat. Stash Stash. <laughs> That's a good name. Well, what's Luigi wearing right now? Actually, I think he's still wearing the frickin' gloves that he got that gave him the 15% at the start of battle. I could give him 
Could give him that. It increases his stash by seven. Or I can give Luigi the roulette gloves as well. Yeah, for fun. Yeah, the Groove Boots just increase speed. They're, they're for fun. Hang on, let me, uh, let me sell some stuff. I'm gonna sell, uh, Super Boots. Sell the, uh, Super Hammer. I have two Knockout Hammers. Sharp Cask Hammer. I wonder if that's any good. Coin glasses. I'll keep it. I'm a greedy bitch. <laughs> Is that hammer any good? Oh yeah, it's really good. Dang. Give that to Luigi then. There we go. Anything new for, for Luigi? Nah, okay. I'll keep that. So we just have the Left Behind Toad on all sand islands, so that's all we gotta do left. Um, my VP will be fine. I'm kinda glad they tell you where to go on the islands, because it would be kind of annoying to figure that out. Some good juice. Alright, so where is the toad at? Oh, he's right over there, okay. Yeah. We just gotta go up here. Fuck. Didn't want to fight this thing, but all right. I guess a bit of extra experience can help, or can hurt. It will help. <laughs> That's the whole point. Yeet. We freed so many Yoshis, dude. There's another lucky. Nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and Luigi still got loss of experience. Hey, don't I have some beans? No, I don't. Mario, Luigi, what can I do for you? Oh, you found another message? An island full of pipes? Could it be? Wait just a moment, please. Let's see. No, not this one. Or that one. Ah, got it. This treasure map shows an island full of pipes in the burning sea. Could you show me your ocean map, Mario? Ocean map. All the way over there. Should be somewhere around here. You be careful now. Luigi, Luigi, take me with you. Hey. You promise not to go wandering off on any more solo missions. Okay. Alright, um... Well, now we can return to ship shape. Now we're done. Look at me fishing up all these side quests. Man, I'm so... Man, I'm so stylish. Probably gonna go have uh, some lunch after I record this one. So, uh, maybe I should go to the spa, just in case. I did use a bit of BP, to be fair. I love how everybody, like, kind of wanders around the island. It really makes it feel more alive, you know? 
Wait, hang on, what's my playtime? 26 hours, damn! Bro, th if this was any other Mario & Luigi game, it probably would have been done by now. <laughs> well, actually, no, not really. <laughs> I think maybe for the first two Mario & Luigi's. Okay, so we can go... It doesn't really matter which current we go to. Let's do both of them, though, just, just because... We've been going in circles for a while. I probably should have done these earlier, but I ended up not doing that. So let's, uh, let's clear up these. Oh, wait, hang on. There's a reef over there. Oh, wait, never mind. We can't reach it. Wait, no, we can. We can reach that reef. Oh, a drifting island. What's this island? Bitsy Islet. That's a completely different one. Well, I guess we'll go there then. Oh shit, I'm blasting off again! Oh wow, look at this place. Well now, look at you folks. That was a spirited landing! Very exciting indeed! My name is Ryder O'Reilly. I've been interested in music for many years. You daring fellas there, would you like to try your hand at a little challenge? If you push this switch, musical notes will appear. I'll give you my treasure if you collect all the notes. Yay! Um... I can't check the map from here. Um, but wait, how do I, uh, what do I do? Oh, do I have to be a ball? Oh, shit. <laughs> There's so many notes. Oh, no, I'm gonna run out of time, bruh. I couldn't figure out the solution in time, dang it. Oh shit, I have to untransform. Ooh! Wait, I got to jump with the ball, I'm stupid. That is a cool, that is a cool ball, ball puzzle we got here. Come on, get it, get it, get it, please. Please, Mario, please! Yeah, we got a cool clear text. Congratulations! Now, come this way, I'll give you my treasure. And she turns out to be a monster. Raw. <laughs> wow. You fellas did well, I've got another challenge. Ooh. Oops, looks like that's a, one, that's one's a bit beyond you for now. How about you return once you can move around faster? Oh. So, wait, hang on. Is the ball gonna... Is the ball actually gonna get an upgrade? I, I mean, I was wondering about that. Because, like, the ball seems really freaking slow right now, but... Man, that kind of just confirms it, doesn't it, that the ball's gonna get an upgrade later on. Okay, I'm going to, uh, prepare and then we're gonna go find it. We're gonna- we got some reefs we can get. So let's do that then. Yeah. There's a, there's a reef coming up. Racer's Reef! Kinda looks like a boonie. I think we have like half the reefs now, almost. And then Bitsy Islet. Okay. Let's, uh, let's clear up some of this map. I don't know, I, I don't know if map completion is a thing. Not too sure. 
I'm kind of I'm kind of looking for some more references, you know. I, I like I like some of these reefs, but my favorite ones are definitely the ones that reference older Mario and Luigi games. Okay, so this kind of links back around to itself. Interesting. Let's zoom out a bit. We can get a better look at things. Are we gonna get like even faster sailing maybe later? That'd be nice. Oh, we got another drifting island. Bulbfish Island. Well, that's I think that's just straight up the next island. <laughs> okay, cool. I tell you what we're gonna do. Um, actually, I don't think I can progress. No, I think I have to go to this island. Okay, well let's go there then. Well, we'll have a little look at it. It seems like on average I get like one or one and a half islands finished per episode. <laughs> oh, it's like nighttime now. Well, Luigi's not eating shit as often. Everybody's wearing overalls. What the hell is going on here? Welcome to Bullfish Island. Wow, haven't said that in a while. It's nice to see visitors, but some of our residents are acting strangely unfriendly. Even when it's dark, this is usually such a peaceful island. What's going on? I like, uh, I like the ocean kind of aspects on this island. Syrup jar and a mushroom. Man, why are we getting such bad, like, lame items late game? <laughs> Chilium. This island's so dark and gloomy all the time. The thick cloud over the chill, or the island makes it seem like night even when it's day. What are you saying? Just pretend like I'm not here. It's as unimportant- I'm as unimportant as the rocks. You wouldn't speak with rocks, so please don't speak with me. What's going on with you? I thought we were friends. Yeah, we're your buds, but you're acting like you don't care about us. I hate strangers! From now on, everyone's a stranger to me. I don't need anyone else. I only need me. What's going on around here? What's with all the rejectiness? Yeah, you and I are truly strange- truly are strangers here, but even against the gloomy sky and gloomier attitudes. You're my sunshine, Bernadette. Chilium, you're so adorable! Oh, I do love you so! Speaking of strangers, here are some new faces. This is Mario and Luigi, and I'm Snoutlet. We're trying to stitch this busted world back together. You three seem like a friendly trio. Everyone on our islands was against their wedding, so we up and left. We fled our beloved homes, but um, it's not quite so simple. I'm Chilean, Prince of Slip and Glide Island. And I'm Bernadette, proud prince of Scorchin people. A scorching people of the of the scorching people. Our peoples have been enemies for years now, so we escaped to beautiful Bullfish Island. Despite that, I'm getting worried about my parents back home. But we can't get off the island, so we can't we just go on a lot of dates. Well, you can relax, cause these two have already reconnected a whole bunch of islands. Wonderful! Chilium and I can date in peace! The island chief knows about the lighthouse. I think his house is up these staircases. Word to the wise, though, a lot of the local folks seem to be acting very strangely. Maybe we're not just used to their customs, but it feels very odd. Keep that in mind. Alright, well, where's the safe point? I'm going there first. Actually, there's some stuff I can break. One coin. Um. Ooh, ultra syrup jars. Oh, but they're so expensive, though. Yeah, I might as well just stick to super syrup jars. Yeah. 
Alright. Um, sell these mushrooms, we don't need those. Sell a couple super shrooms. I mean, hey, I mean, one up deluxe to sell for a lot of money, right? That's always good. Not. And I'll sell these candies too. I'm gonna sell a bunch of my stuff that I don't want. Handcrafted bait. Oh, I forgot I bought that. Well, sell that too. I I could sell this stuff and save up for the um the gold gloves. Also, don't think don't think I don't notice that freaking hidden block there. Another super mushroom. Since the incident happened, so many people have gone barging in on the chief at home. I wonder if he's okay. Hope he's not pulling his somewhat limited hair over this mess. I'm curious about the island news, but I got a store to attend. What do you need? Uh, forge boots. Increase the damage you deal by 30 when your health is low. Oh, hell yeah. Dude, danger strats are back, baby. Danger strats time. We're putting those on immediately. Increase the damage you deal by 30 when your HP is full. <laughs> oh, man. Um, the fewer enemies there are, the less damage you take. Interesting. I might buy those. Yeah, I think that's good. Alright, well, sell the super boots. Sell the elite boots. We don't need those now. Sell the super hammer. Uh, don't need the sturdy wear anymore, or the bros wear. Um, I might s oh yeah, right, I have this gold medallion. Oh yeah, two gold medallions. Hey, look at that, I'm back up to two- I'm back up to 9k. I I'm keeping the coin glasses. There we go. Well, I think with that... Are you safe? I hate it, I hate it, I hate so much. I don't even know what it is that I hate. And I hate it, I don't know what I hate. Uh, you better be careful, buddy. You two doesn't like hate speech. <laughs> Alright. Well, I think that's a good place to end the episode. So, as always, guys, make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. And I guess in the next episode, whenever that'll be, we will do uh, Bulbafish Island. I don't know how long it'll take. We'll see, because... Uh, this is a pretty interesting looking island with all these, uh, you know, negative Nancys all over the place. So, uh, I'll see you guys then.